Greetings from the highlands of Papua New Guinea. I want to thank you for partnering with me in the development of the National Church on the Melanesia and the South Pacific fields. Dusin is high in the mountains at the heart of PNG, a remote village only reached by small plane or a multiple day hike. One day I received a phone call from a pastor near Dusin on the Middle Ramu district. He called asking for an offering book so he could train pastors around him on how to keep church finances. He had hiked many hours over mountain trails to find a place high enough that he could receive a cell phone signal to make his call. This is an example of church development, equipping our national leaders to train others and become better leaders themselves. As field church development coordinator, my desire is to empower our national leaders, equipping them so that they are able to grow the church on the Melanesia and the South Pacific fields. On these two fields are 16 districts, ranging from pioneer areas to phase one, two, and three districts. There are around a thousand churches spread across seven island nations. As you can see, the need is great for church development as the churches and districts continue to grow. We are working to provide training in areas such as church structure, judicial procedures and disciplinary actions, along with training in district conventions and district assemblies. We want to help our pastors and leaders with training in the development of church boards, district advisory, and ministerial credential boards. As our national leaders express areas where they would like training, we will be working to provide it. Here on the Melanesia and South Pacific field, we are actively pursuing the Asia Pacific regional priorities of intentional leadership and district development. The growth of the global church will only happen if the local churches and districts are healthy. Thank you for your prayers and partnership as together we are seeing great strides in growth among our churches and leaders and the lives of many Pacific Islanders transformed for eternity. Thank you for all that you have done and are going to do.